Keep your home safe from lead by following the tips shared in this video. Hello and welcome. Today we will be talking about how to stay safe from lead hazards in and around your home. Lead can be found in many places around your house, including paint, pipes, air, dirt, dust, food, dishes, and water. Lead can be harmful for all people, but is especially dangerous for children under the age of six and for pregnant women. High blood lead levels can lead to learning disabilities, behavioral problems, growth problems, and other health issues. Most homes built before 1978 have lead paint in them. When the paint peels, cracks, or is worn down, the chips and dust from the old lead paint can spread around your home. When you and your children walk into the house, it's a good idea to take off your shoes at the door. If you have pets, be sure to clean their paws when they come in from outside. This may stop dirt, lead paint, dust, and other hazards from getting into your house. It also helps to use a doormat at every entrance to trap dirt and dust. Look at the inside and outside doors in your home. If you see any paint chips or dust, clean it with a wet wipe or wet mop. Do not use a broom because that could cause chips or dust to spread. Check the siding, porch, garage, trim, windows, and doors outside your home for peeling paint. Dirt can have lead in it, so make sure children play on the grass instead of in the dirt. If you have a vegetable garden, keep it away from the house, driveway, and drip line. Dirt can have old lead paint chips or dust, so it's best to create a raised bed garden using dirt bought from the store. Eating healthy foods helps to protect against lead poisoning. Foods with iron, vitamin C, and calcium can help prevent lead poisoning and should be included with every meal. Eat in clean places that have a lower risk for lead exposure. For example, at a table instead of on the floor. Always wash your hands with soap and water before eating a meal or snacks. Some spices and herbal remedies may also contain lead, especially if they're imported from another country that doesn't have strict rules about lead in food. It is safest to purchase spices produced in the United States. It's important to check your dishes too. Traditional pottery and ceramic ware may contain lead. Look for a label that says, lead free. Don't eat from dishes that are for decoration only. If you're not sure if a dish contains lead, don't use it. Lead can also be found in plumbing. Make a habit of letting the water run until it's very cold before using it. Only use cold water for cooking, drinking, and making baby formula. Boiling water will not remove the lead. Faucet or water pitcher filters can help, but make sure it is certified by NSF International by visiting nsf.org. You can test your water for lead. For more information, call EPA Safe Drinking Water Hotline at 1-800-426-4791. Make sure the rooms where children play and sleep don't have lead in them. Keep the crib and play areas away from walls, windows, and doors with chipping or peeling paint. Clean your windows every month. Use a wet wipe or cloth for cleaning dust or chipped paint. Do not use a broom because that could cause the chips or dust to spread. Paint chips may taste sweet and appeal to young children. Keep your children away from window sills, especially if they are teething. Be sure children do not put their mouths on the window sills. Some vinyl blinds may have lead in them, so keep children and their bed or crib away from the blinds. Lead is sometimes found in children's toys and old furniture. If a toy is damaged, throw it away. If the toy has dust on it, clean it with a wet cloth. To find out if there are any lead recalls, sign up for the recall list at www.saferproducts.gov or call 1-800-638-2772. Clean your home every week. Vacuum with a high-efficiency particulate air vacuum or HEPA vacuum. Use a wet mop to clean floors. Wet wipes work well to clean dust, and you can throw them away when you are done. Do not use a broom because it could cause paint chips or dust to spread. If you're planning on any home improvement projects, ask your contractor for lead safety for renovation, repair and painting, or RRP certificate. If you're doing the work yourself, 
Take the RRP training to help you understand how to keep your workspace safe during renovations and cleanup. During your home improvement project, be sure children and pregnant women stay away from the work area. Many communities have programs that can help you remove lead from your home. Call your local health department for more information. Some jobs and hobbies may involve coming into contact with lead. This may include painters, artists, construction workers, and people who fish. Take off your work shoes before entering your home. Wash your work clothes separately from other clothes. Be sure to wash your hands with soap and water before having contact with your children. Wash your hands and your child's hands before and after eating, after playing, and after changing a diaper. Children under the age of six years old are at the highest risk for lead poisoning because they tend to put their hands and other items in their mouths. Exposure to lead can create many health problems that can last a long time, including learning disabilities, behavioral problems, and other health problems. Be sure to test your children for lead at one and two years old. Call your child's doctor or your local county health department to find out how to have your child tested. Even though lead is most dangerous to children under six, it is still harmful to older children and adults. Lead isn't safe for anyone. It is much easier to prevent lead poisoning than to treat it. Use the wet cleaning method whenever you're cleaning your home. If you have any questions, contact 211 or your local county health department.